subscribe our channel for daily technology and smartphone videos hello friends welcome to my youtube channel and today finally oneplus 5d is receiving a stable oxygen os 5.1.4 yes please highlight the word stable because it's almost after two months oneplus is oneplus 5d is receiving a stable update in terms of oxygen os 5.1.4 so in the coming section of this video i will show you how to downgrade from uh, or how to revert back from open beta to stable then how to flash this particular update and what are the new features involved in this particular update and how to delete cache from recovery mode so if you like this video please hit like and subscribe to our channel so without any further delay let's get started friends this is my oneplus 5d device and let me show you my current version And as you can see, my current version is Open Beta 12, which is running on Open Beta 12 version. And let me show you the community section where this patch has been arrived. 5.1.4. So this is a change log for OnePlus 5T and OnePlus 5 or Oxygen OS 5.1.4. And as you can see, they have mentioned that the security patch has been updated to July. They have added sleep standby optimization, which will improve your battery life. Again, they have improved your photo clarity. So this is a major update for camera. Again, they have added group messaging and they have some general bug fixes in gallery section. So this is a major update because they have improved your battery life. They have improved your camera and some general bug fixes. So these all are open beta 10 and open beta 12 features, which now they are rolling to the stable version. So as I show my current version is open beta 12. So I will show you how to downgrade to open beta 12 to stable version. First, you will need to download downgrade to either 5.1.3 or 5.1.2, whichever file you have available. So I have a 5.1.2 available with me. So I will reboot this phone into recovery mode. So first I need to power off this phone. Then press power button and volume down button simultaneously. Enter your password or pattern English first wipe cache done go to install from internal storage now this is my 5.1.2 file you can either install 5.1.2 or 5.1.3 whichever is up whichever is available so I'm just tapping this file now from to revert back from open beta to stable you will need to reset your system settings so all your applications will get deleted and user data will be safe so yes it will take couple of minutes to flash this file after a couple of minutes it says install success hit yes again wipe cache and reboot again it will take couple of minutes to complete the reboot process so reboot is completed and as you can see all my system settings has been resetted so i will quickly uh, set up this device and will come back soon so friends setup is completed and as you can see all my applications are get deleted so it's basically a system setting reset and uh, all my photos and videos and all this uh, stuff is remain same so there won't be any deletion of user data only deletion of application so you need to install the applications manually by going into the library section so let me show you you can go to library over here and here you will find all your install applications and you can install it from here so it's the same way so by this way you can uh, revert back from open beta to stable version so now we are in a stable version so we will see how to install the 5.1.4 oxygen os version in this oneplus 5t so now the main things which they have mentioned in the community section is that it cannot be downloaded via vpn method you can see the ota will have stage rollout and the ota will receive by a limited number of users today and a broader number of users 
and so using vpn to download this build might not work as the rollout is not based on the regions so if you use vpn method and connect to germany and canada then this method will not work and you will not get any uh, ota update so for that you need to download the oxygen os updater app this is a third party application so let me show you this is a third party application and not a oneplus application you need to install this applications and when you, you install this application go to the application and set up this application and you will find 5.1.4 and this is the complete build which i have already installed so let me show you in file manager this is a build so i will uh, reboot my phone into recovery mode to enable recovery mode go to about phone tap build number 7 time then you will be a developer once you are in developer mode go to developer option and here enable advanced reboot so it will make sure that your recovery mode will be activated so then long press power button reboot recovery enter the password choose english first wipe cache done install from internal storage and this is the file which we have uh, downloaded today so i will just tap on this file install package js yes. it will take couple of minutes to complete the installation process Once installation is completed, hit yes, again go to wipe data and cache, wipe cache, yes, and the reboot. So reboot is completed, let me enter the password. System settings, about phone. And here you will find Oxygen OS version 5.1.4. And uh, as you can see, July security patch has been updated to July 1, 2018. So let's see the change log one by one. So let me go to the community app it's over here. So we have already seen that the security patch has been updated to July. Now for sleep standby optimization in battery settings, go to settings and then go to battery section and go to battery optimization three dots advanced optimization and here enable both these options advanced optimization and sleep standby it will improve your battery life to the great extent now improve photo clarity so this i will need to test the camera explicitly because uh, in low light and all these conditions and i think front portrait is still not yet added so i will test the camera function and uh, the next option is uh, they have added group messaging in the message section and improve bug fixes in gallery so gallery is working fine you can see there might be some bugs which they have fixed if you are comfortable with oxygen os updater then you can update it via oxygen os updater else wait and then it will pop up in your system update setting after three four days in the india region or uh, whatever region you might be but the vpn method will not work in this particular case so guys that's it for today's video and i hope you like this video if you like this video please hit like and subscribe to our channel we will see in the next upcoming video till then thank you very much and see you soon